Hi everyone. Today we're looking at how to use Font Awesome with Avada. Make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel to keep up with all the latest videos like this one. And if you don't want to miss one, click the bell icon to get notifications of all new videos on our channel. OK, let's begin. Font Awesome is the world's most popular and easiest to use icon set and comes in both free and premium versions. We have integrated it with Avada, so you have instant access to almost 1600 free icons to use in your site design. There is also Font Awesome Pro integration in Avada, so if you have a Font Awesome Pro account, you can access the full range of icons and all subsets. The best place to start with Font Awesome is in the Theme Options, on the Advanced Theme Features page. Down the page a bit, there are three options relevant to the use of Font Awesome in Avada. Firstly, you can choose your icon subsets under the Font Awesome option. There are four subsets you can load, but note that the light subset can only be used if Font Awesome Pro is enabled. The next option is called Font Awesome Version 4 Compatibility, and you can turn this on to enable support for the Font Awesome 4 icon code format. This would be useful on sites with old code, where Font Awesome icons were added in this manner, but otherwise it's not needed. Finally, with the last option, you can enable Font Awesome Pro. You need to have a Pro license for this to work, and you also need to whitelist the domain via your Font Awesome account. One extra Font Awesome option is found under the Privacy tab. Here, with the Google and Font Awesome Font Mode option, you can choose between Local and CDN. Choosing CDN will use the Font Awesome Content Delivery Network, while Local will mean the icon sets are downloaded to your own server. Depending on your privacy requirements with the GDPR, this option may be one you need to look at. OK, to use Font Awesome icons is very easy, as we have integrated them throughout Avada. First and foremost, you will find them in the aptly named Icon element. This used to be called the Font Awesome icon element, but with Avada 6.2 we renamed it, as you can now add custom icon sets you have uploaded through Icomoon into the element as well. And it's not just the icon element. Font Awesome icons can also be found in several other elements, including the Alert, Button, Checklist, and content boxes element to name just a few. In short, anywhere you find the icon picker, you will be able to use the font awesome icons in your content. Here on the electrician demo, as we scroll down the page, we can see some font awesome icons that were added via the content boxes element. And further down, a whole bunch of font awesome icons that were added using the icon element. If I just edit one of these, we can see the icon picker with the three Font Awesome icon subsets we selected in the theme options. We can scroll and search through these to find the icon we want to use, and below this are a range of options to style the icons as we wish. For more info on how to configure and style the icons, please see the How to Use the Icon Element video, linked here. OK, with Font Awesome icons in Nevada, you get a lot of choice, with currently almost 1600 icons in the free set alone. And if that's not enough icons for you, if you connected a Font Awesome Pro account to Avada, you would have access to almost 8,000 Font Awesome icons. OK, this concludes our video on how to use Font Awesome with Avada. Make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel to keep up with all the latest videos. And if you have any questions or need assistance, please create a support ticket and our team will gladly assist you. As always, we want to thank you for choosing Avada.